We knew we'd get large numbers and we were expecting to get something, but to break a million was a was a surprise for everybody. A record smashing surprise and what's become a banner season for young salmon at Baker River. And I can't even imagine how many I've counted personally, but uh, it's been a, quite a few. Mike Ficklin is part of the Puget Sound Energy Fisheries crew that samples or counts large numbers of the juvenile sockeye and coho that swim through here. At the height of the outward migration back in May, the holding areas were thick with salmon smolt. The raceways that our, the fish are coming into are just almost black. You can't even see the bottom sometimes. There's a lot of fish. Workers identify the different species and by checking if a certain fin has been clipped can tell if the fish is from the nearby hatchery or from the wild. We've been implementing uh, uh, our program for years and so it's been a natural evolution of that. Uh, studying the watershed and uh, learning more about it and, and having success each year and building upon that success. PSE credits the advanced fish hatchery with dramatically increasing the production of young salmon. Using high-tech equipment, crews also help the fish continue swimming out to sea with the help of two floating surface collectors, which safely funnel and hold juvenile salmon for truck transport downstream around the two Baker River dams using the famous fish taxis. There's always this potential of, of reaching the million. We didn't know that it would be this soon. I think in a lot of people's minds, it was something in the future. As recently as the mid-1980s, the salmon population was nearly extinct in this area of the North Cascades. Over the past 10 years, PSE has invested more than $150 million to bring the salmon back to Baker. This season's epic migration sets up the possibility of a record adult return in a couple of years. Uh, with over a million smolts out this year, we could potentially see anywhere from 6 to 10 percent return. So we could get 60 to 100,000 adults back. But for now, the juveniles make their harrowing journey out into Puget Sound with plenty of company. At Baker Lake, I'm Ray Lane for PSC TV. You didn't show them the fish dance yet, did you? I was going to kind of key that in.